Hey everyone, this is Ranger Eric, and as I'm sure y'all have figured out recently, it's been warming up. And with that, like I've said in a couple other videos, that uh, brings out the snakes in better numbers. So today's a pretty prime example of that. I'm actually out here flipping some cover I have in the park, and uh, we just got our first snake underneath the stuff that I put out for these guys. This is a very, very special snake that I'm very happy to see. This is a speckled king snake, Lampropeltus halbrichai, and this guy's pretty young. I would say he's probably last year's baby. If I'm off by that, it's not by a lot. He's only a year or two old. This snake will grow one of these days to get to about five-ish foot long. They get really, really big. And as the name implies, one of the big ways that you can identify these guys is that they have this speckling color all throughout their body. Now, you'll notice with this guy, he actually has some horizontal banding going across his back. And that's actually something that you really only see with the juveniles of this species. As they grow older, uh, at least with the speckled king snakes, that banding on the back actually begins to fade and they're left with only speckling. Now, depending on where you are in the United States, king snakes are not all going to look exactly the same. Some subspecies will maintain that banding throughout their entire life, and uh, some subspecies banding is all they have in the case of, you know, say the eastern king snake way out on the east coast. These guys are really well known for eating other snakes, including venomous ones like copperheads. Uh, obviously, this guy's probably not gonna be eating venomous snakes right now, just because he's pretty small, but once he gets larger and he gets up into a similar size class as uh, something like a copperhead or a rattlesnake, he certainly will start eating those. Right now, he's mostly gonna be eating smaller snakes like decays brown snakes, things of that sort, as well as lizards. These guys are big reptile eaters aside from just snakes. This is another species of snake I anticipate that I will see tons of in the park as time goes on, so I'm just gonna leave it at that. And uh, as I find more of these guys, I'll give y'all more information on them. But how about that? The speckled king snake, Lampropeltis halbrichai. Y'all have a good one. Stay safe outside as always, and uh, I'll see y'all on the next video.